So here we are on the Gregory Highway in central Queensland, just um, about 20 k's north of Capella. And here you and I are witnessing a terrible, terrible tragedy that is taking place right now in Australia and especially in this area due to a directive from the Department of Main Roads, would you believe, to the local councils to poison, to poison everything and anything up to about 80 millimetres or 8 centimetres in, in diameter. And so here what we are witnessing right before our very eyes is the death of five of the most precious trees in the whole face of the earth. The Gumby Gumby tree, Petostrum angustifolium. This is perhaps the most sacred tree of traditional owners in Australia. The local Wangan and Jagalingu people are up in arms about this, what is happening at the moment, with the councils following the directive of the Department of Main Roads going round and spraying these precious trees. It's horrific. You know, what are we doing here? This is crazy. This is insane. The most precious tree. A wonderful health-giving tree, the Gumby Gumby tree. Do your own research on Gumby Gumby on the internet and see all of the many incredible things this tree can do for human beings. It actually saved my life. I won't go into details, but you'll find so many, so many amazing things about this Gumby Gumby tree on the internet. And here we have this council following the directive of the main roads, going round and spraying these beautiful trees. Just look at this. Here's five precious Gumby Gumby trees. And the overspray from it is going around and it's poisoned or started to poison this magnificent tree here. Now this one, with the thickness of the trunk here, uh, I mean, that tree would have to be about 60 years old. Can you imagine that? And these other trees are probably at least 10 or 20 years old. So to replace these trees is very hard. It's, very, it's hard, they're a rare tree. They don't just happen like that. You just can't go out and plant these trees. It's amazing how they are generated and, and how they grow. And now here we have an example just nearby is a case of a black wattle tree, which is not a great tree as far as farmers are concerned because it tends to grow prolifically as we can see here but they haven't poisoned these trees these black wattle trees no and i wouldn't encourage them to do so anyway but now they've singled out for special treatment the most precious and rare valuable probably the most sacred tree to the aboriginal people in australia the traditional owners this is their most sacred tree the gumby gumby tree and here in human terms they have brutally murdered them can you believe that this is insanity, and it should be stopped. And here's why. This young council worker was busily spraying poison along the Gregory Highway, so I stopped to talk to him. I asked him how long he'd been in the job, and he said, oh, only three weeks. And I said, you don't have any protective uh, clothing, you don't have any protective gloves, you don't have any protective eyewear or any protective masks, no protective clothing whatsoever. Has anybody given you any instruction? Oh no, not really. Uh, do you know what you're doing or what you're spraying for? Oh no, not really. Um, do you know what a Gumby Gumby tree looks like? Never heard of it. Uh, and this is the sort of thing that we have uh, in the councils, uh, spraying ostensibly uh, noxious weeds, but they don't really know what they're doing and many more Gumby Gumby trees have been poisoned along the Gregory Highway and along the arterial roads near Capella. In fact there's whole sections of arterial roads that have been bulldozed by the council for no real explicable reason. This is a classic case in point. Here is one magnificent sole surviving Gumby Gumby tree and just take a look at this. In this road reserve here there were probably around 50 Gumby Gumby trees and someone in their bulldozers have come along here and raised it to the ground. Over 50 precious Gumby Gumby trees, Petostrum angustifolium, 
just razed to the ground and destroyed. Why? Why would you destroy such a beautiful tree? The most amazing tree on earth, the Potostrum angustifolium tree, a rare tree with amazing qualities for the health of human beings. Oh dear. It leaves my heart in despair. It leaves the traditional owners of this land distraught when they see that it's such a destruction.